Our cities are increasingly becoming congested every day. Transport, housing, and carbon emissions are one of the biggest challenges faced by major urban centers today. There's never been a better time to rethink urban transport in the wake of sustainability goals set by countries around the world. China Railway Rolling Stock Corporation has been developing autonomous rapid transit technology and introduced an autonomously guided tram system which runs on the road without any tracks. Unlike conventional trams, it does not use overhead wires, rather it runs on rubber tires guided by optical, radar, LiDAR, and GPS technology autonomously. It can be described as a crossover between a bus and a light rail. The lane departure warning system keeps it from drifting. Anti-collision system maintains a safe distance from other vehicles. The trackless tram offers a stable, comfortable, and quiet riding experience traveling at up to 70 km per hour, unlike the jerkiness and slowness of conventional buses thanks to the stabilizing technology from the high-speed rail. The system is flexible to add or reduce the number of carriages. With three carriages, it can carry 300 passengers. Similar to a metro train, it features a twin head system, meaning no U-turns. The most touted elements are its carbon neutrality and cost effectiveness along with rapid deployment. 10 minutes of fast charge provides 25 km of range and the batteries will be topped up at every station during passenger load, unload and at the end of the line. As for the manufacturer, the system costs one-fifth of a traditional tram system and can be deployed as fast as the city's permitting process would allow. The body lifespan is 25 years, three times the conventional bus. The company has developed roadside sensors to work intelligently with traffic light system to give priority to the tram. Under congestion scenarios, the tram can be diverted to alternate routes since it requires no physical rail track. As with every new technology, trackless tram has attracted some criticism. Critics are of the view that it's just a fancy electric bus in the shape of a tram with all the latest road driving tech available. Having no rail, it will still require a dedicated lane to be efficient to avoid road congestion. The cost saved on infrastructure may end up on large and expensive batteries. The weight of the tram is another factor to be considered as it may damage unsuitable roads and the road infrastructure might need to be resurfaced. Vendor lock-in is also a risk factor highlighted by the experts as only a couple of companies are working on this tech. Long-term maintenance estimates are not available as the technology is still immature with no implementation outside of China. ART has been operational in China since 2018. First introduced in Zhuzhou, it expanded to Yibin and Harbin with planning and construction of new systems underway in five other cities in China. In 2019, the company carried out high temperature tests in Qatar. The city of Stirling in Western Australia has secured the tram as part of Australia's first trial of the system. Dubai's Road and Transport Authority has signed an agreement with a Chinese company to carry out a feasibility study on operating a trackless tram system in the Emirate. The technology is on its way to attract global interest with proposals for routes in Malaysia, Israel, Zimbabwe and elsewhere. What about your area? Do you think trackless tram can secure a route in your city? Let us know in the comments below. Thank you for watching. If you liked the video, please share it with your friends and family and consider subscribing to the channel for more.